This summer, my mom has found me and my sister to be pretty bored at some times. So to help that boredness, my mom decided for me and my sister to sometimes make dinner for our family. I thought this was going to be really easy, but turns out it's a lot more difficult than I thought. I'm not trying to complicate none of this, none of this, so let me just, let me just, let me just come tell you how I feel. My mom told us that we could cook whatever we wanted, of course, I went straight to Pinterest. Since I was going to be cooking on Tuesday, I thought what better than Taco Tuesday. I decided to make these shrimp tacos because I love seafood. Tacos are something super easy because people can sort of customize it any way they want. The first thing was to actually get all the ingredients I needed and a lot of that stuff I did not have. So my mom got some of that stuff of Instacart around 4.30 and it would come around 5.30. First she just got here, as you guys can tell. And now I'm basically going to start cooking and I'm kind of nervous because I've never made like such a complicated meal before but I'm super excited. I thought 5.30 would be the perfect time to start cooking. On Pinterest it says 20 minutes to make. That's for like a professional. Once everything came, the first thing I had to do was actually make a sauce. The sauce was super simple. It was just ranch and sriracha. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is making a sriracha ranch, which is basically just sriracha and ranch. And personally, I don't really like sriracha. Fortunately, I saw that we had a bottle of ranch, but I didn't realize that the ranch was almost gone. I made a tiny bit of a sriracha ranch and ended up later having to make a sriracha mayo, which was just as good. Next thing I had to do was make the coleslaw. And unfortunately, I didn't have a big thing of cabbage because my mom said that shredding cabbage takes so much time. So she bought me like this prepackaged one with some carrots in it. So the first thing that I had to do was actually cut the jalapenos, which is probably the hardest part for me. For the jalapenos, I had to remove the stem, seeds, ribs, and cut into strips and mites. Honestly, I had no idea what that meant. So I was kind of just going all after it. I was just cutting off the top of them. I was cutting them in half, and I was trying my best to take out all the seeds, and then I was just mincing them. And later, I actually realized what mincing meant, so I had to go back and cut them into even smaller pieces until I could finally put them into the coleslaw. After that, I just put in the cabbage, the apple cider vinegar, the honey, the salt, and the pepper. And that was pretty much it for the coleslaw. This part was kind of confusing because I've never worked with shrimp before. I just had this big bag of frozen shrimp and the first thing I guess I had to do was thaw it. So I put it into the strainer and I ran warm water over it and I wasn't even sure when to stop. And then I had to pat them dry. I just patted them dry with a paper towel, which I'm not sure you're supposed to do either. But this took forever. At this point it was like 6.30 and I could tell my family was getting hungry. Next I had to marinate the shrimp in paprika, cayenne, garlic, salt, and pepper. and and then just mix it all together. And there was a lot of shrimp. My mom got two pounds of it. After that, I cooked the shrimp and I had no idea what I was doing. I just sort of dumped them all on there, stirred them around until they turned more of a grayish color. This recipe actually called for one pound of shrimp. So it said two minutes on each side and my pan was just filled with shrimp. I didn't even know if some got cooked at all. Then of course I found out I was doing it wrong about 10 minutes into the process of cutting up the shrimp. I was cutting them and then my mom said to not cut them, even though Pinterest said to. After I cut up like four or five shrimp, I just put those to the side and then I basically just took off the tails of all the shrimp. My hands got really messy because the shrimp were like super marinated. After I made a sriracha mayo, which I did not show because I despise mayo so much, but I actually really liked sriracha mayo, which is really weird. I made a sriracha mayo because we had like this much sriracha ranch. It was like barely any. I also toasted about 10 tortillas, which also took a little bit of time. Basically just put everything out on the bar and then we moved it to the table. My family did not start eating until 7.30, which is super late for us. We normally eat dinner around like 5.30, 6 the latest. Pinterest literally said it took 20 minutes and it took me about 
an hour. Overall, I didn't think I could do it and I honestly got super lazy and at some points my arm was hurting because I was cutting up so many jalapenos. Thankfully, I did not touch my eye. I did touch my mouth though and it burned like really bad after I was cutting up the jalapenos. Yeah, I feel like I did a pretty good job and my family liked it. Even though it took me a really long time, I would definitely make it again. What did you think about the shrimp tacos? They were good. <laughs> The shrimp was like really good and the sauces that you made with it was also really good. I thought they were good for somebody who doesn't cook. I was expecting them to be bad, so I lowered my expectations, so that's why they are pretty good. What about presentation? I got like the table set. It was like good because you put like the shrimp on like a big plate, so it like stood out and like the stuff that you put it on and the sauce. Presentation. Well, um, I didn't really pay attention, but what I remember is that there didn't look like there was a lot of sauce, but that's okay because there was enough. And the shrimp was on a cutting board, I believe. That's all I remember. And then there was like coleslaw in a bowl. It's regular presentation. About timing. It took a little bit, a little longer than I thought it was going to, but I knew that it was worth it. I wasn't very hungry. I didn't think it took too long. Everybody else thought that it took long, so I'm gonna say it took a little bit. No, it's okay, guys. It's worth it. Is that all you wanna say about them? It was really good, and the sauces were probably my favorite part. Like, sriracha ranch and the sriracha mayo. It went really good with the coleslaw and the um, shrimp. First of all, I don't like coleslaw. Second of all, I don't like mayonnaise. Definitely the shrimp. Actually, yeah, the tortilla was good too. There was nothing that could be better, but by the way guys, I'm like a picky eater, so I don't like food. I don't like a lot of food, right? Okay, so like going from my point of view, it's not very good because like, no, the shrimp tacos were good, but it's not, I'm not a good person to ask because I don't like food. What was the question again? Oh yeah, nothing could be better, than it already was, but it just wasn't not my first choice. But since I had to eat it, it was not bad. You guys should try this at home. Even though most things say don't try this at home, you should put on do try this at home.